Okay, so I will just explain you a little bit about trend lines and candle patterns. Then we'll go in detail on how they work using the Thinkorswim tool. So a trend line is simply a line uh, that connects the prices for a stock. So if I take an example here, if you go here, uh, I have a trend line. This is a trend line which I have created. This trend line, I have started from here, which is the December of 2020. And I've taken this trend line all the way up till today. So this is a trend line which tells me that my current uh, uh, market trend for Amazon, how it is. So anytime my stock goes up uh, above this dark black line, which is a trend line, uh, I would consider that as a positive trend. Anytime it tries to come down or act below the trend line, I would consider that as a negative trend or a bearish trend. So it gives me an idea that yes, at this time of the year, or today, Amazon is not behaving uh, uh, as bullish, but in fact, it is trading in the bearish territory. So I will take some steps back if I want to go long, long meaning I want to be a buyer in Amazon. All right. Similar to that, if anything was up and like in this case here, it was showing me that yes, Amazon was in a bullish trend and I should uh, be a buyer on Amazon and it will benefit me. And I will be a buyer around this range above the trend line and we're looking forward to <clears throat> book some profit at the second trend line and then the third. So in, in, in technical analysis, it is recommended that you enter into a stock. Let's say you enter a hundred stock into any equity. You need to understand to book the profit. Booking profit is really, really important in technical analysis. It gives you like small consistent profit of 20%, 10% in derivative market or about 5 to 10% in equity market is significant returns. So do not trade on the idea that yes, I have bought a stock tomorrow or maybe in a month it will get double, triple or four times or five times. That may happen, but 99% of the times it will not happen and you will end up losing your hard-earned money in that stock. So anytime you see some level of profit, like I usually, if I see uh, in a option contract, 25% of the profit, I definitely book 25% of my uh, option quantity, option launch. Then it goes to 50% of the gains, I try to cut down on the 50%. Similarly, when it went to 75%, I cut down 75%, and then I leave the runners so that in case it moves further, my uh, my trade still remains open. And I don't feel that, yes, I have lost the opportunity to make more money. In case it goes down, you still have 75% profit plus 75% of your initial invested uh, capital is out of the market. Okay, so profit booking is important. And trend lines give you that direction that you enter on the break of the trend line on the upside, wait for the resistance line and in between you can buy and then sell. Similarly, you can sell here on the top of the trend line and then wait for it to go to the bottom and then book it. Okay. Then 